Welcome back everybody. Um, in the last class, we created this sleeve block. And as promised in this class, we're going to shape the sleeve block by creating a dart, by adding a dart to the elbow line. To add a dart to the elbow line, you have to find where your elbow line is. So it's best for you to measure from your shoulder point to where your elbow is and then you find it on your pattern and draw it. Um, the first thing we're going to do is to score a vertical line on another sheet of paper. It's going to serve as our green line. So I'm going to draw a vertical line down a new sheet of paper. On it, I'm going to place my sleeve with the grain line on the same spot. And I'm going to secure it so that it doesn't move while I'm doing it. I'm going to secure it in a few places. Good. Remember that this is my back armhole and this here is my front armhole. So on your elbow line, on your back armhole elbow line, you divide your back armhole elbow line into three places. And for the sake of this class, we're going to label it. So we'll measure what it is. I'm going to do a measurement. My measurement here is 16 centimeters, so I'm going to divide it into three. And dividing my 16 centimeters into three, I have five point, about 5.33. So I'm going, I'm going to divide it here. So I'm going to label this point A, I'm going to label this point B, and I'm going to label the edge X. So I have A, I have B, I have X. You get your scissors, right? And slash from the back sleeve on the elbow line. All the way to the front sleeve. Two and not through, please. Two. The front sleeve. So I'm going to secure this down. Yes. So you open, now you open, you spread your point X. You spread it by 2.5 centimeters. Point X, 2.5 centimeters to create your dots. So I'm spreading 2.5 centimeters. This is my 2.5 centimeters here. And I'm going to secure it so that my pieces are not moving. Good. And I'll label this part X1. So from point X1, you draw a line to point A. And that now has created your dots. 
So what we're going to do right now is that we're going to copy our modified sleeve. to get our shaped sleeve or our darted sleeve now we have our shaped sleeve block to be good to Mark this as a reference line. And voila, we're done. That easy. So I'm going to draw my bicep line. My front armhole, my back armhole my elbow line elbow line my bicep line my top arm so from here you can do whatever you want to do you can decide to add your seam allowances and test your block thank you for joining me for this class in the next class we're going to in the next video we're going to show you how to raise your sleeve head and how to lower your sleeve head. Most times you lower your sleeve head to reduce fullness and you raise the sleeve head to add fullness. Thank you.